and you know a hyperscale data center is using enough power that be the equivalent of a city of a half a million people and in some of the bigger ones maybe even more than that uh, you also have a lot of water consumption you have a, a big geographic footprint which has environmental concerns and so you have all these things and you know our per, our uh, point of view is you know you should not have to pay one dime more in utility costs water uh, power any of this stuff uh, because of this. These are the some of the most wealthy companies in the history uh, of humanity. Uh, they should not be able to offload costs onto people that are already strapped uh, with high costs in other areas. And so, you know, making sure that Floridians are protected against that, you know, I think is really, really important. And I know a lot of people uh, agree with that. You know, the thing about the data centers is there's not really a, a, a big economic impact uh, once they're created. Like, yeah, if it's constructed, people can make some money doing that. Obviously, there may be some jobs that, that can go. But once it's done, it, it employs like a half dozen people. And, you know, these tech companies will likely bring in foreigners to do that on some visa, or they're not going to hire from your local community. That's just not what they do. So, you know, from that, I think a lot of these communities are not supporting the construction in their area when they go before these boards now because they're thinking, like, okay, it's sucking a lot of resources. But is this really something that we need in our community? Is it something that's going to benefit the community? And, and by and large, you know, this is across party lines. I think people are saying no dice on that. So, so I do think that I think there's been a big sea change in how people have thought about that just in the last six to nine months. Um, and you know, it may be that some of the protections we have, you know, end up being moot because it's just not something that's going to get any traction in Florida. Period. Um, and but at the end of the day. This is not something that you should ever have to pay for, uh, no subsidy, none of that, and, and we're going to make that very clear. Uh, we also, 